So we all need some quick, instant dinner recipes to come to the rescue every now and then, don't we? So here's a very simple and quick spaghetti recipe with mushrooms. Just get your spaghetti going and let's get started. So we have 400 grams of spaghetti that has been cooked in salted boiling water. Cook it around 11 to 12 minutes or according to package instructions, just until al dente. While the pasta is cooking, we can get our ingredients ready. You need 5 to 6 shallots that have been finely minced or grated. If you don't have shallots, you can use white onion as well. It's around three tablespoons uh, once it's minced. And we also need three tablespoons of finely grated or minced carrot as well. Now for our mushrooms. We're using fresh as well as canned mushrooms for this recipe. Five to six fresh mushrooms. I'm using Swiss brown mushrooms here to slice them. And here are our canned mushrooms. Around four canned mushrooms sliced as well and set that aside and we want to reserve the liquid from the canned mushrooms for this recipe. So our pasta is cooked and drained. Now to a pan or a deep skillet you want to add four tablespoons of olive oil. To this we're going to add the minced shallots and carrot and just saute briefly. We're also adding two bay leaves here. Once the shallots are softened, you can add the fresh mushrooms. Fry that briefly. And then add the canned mushrooms. Fry this briefly and to this we're going to add one cup of your favorite pasta sauce. Something containing tomatoes, onion and garlic is good. Just going to cook that till the oil separates. And then here I'm adding a quarter cup of banana sauce or tamas angang. This is a Filipino style ketchup or condiment made from banana. This helps to balance the acid um, and, and really taste well in this pasta dish. If you don't have this, you can use a sweet and spicy chili sauce as well. But it, I really recommend trying the banana sauce in your pasta next time. And we're going to add some seasoning powder of your choice. I'm using one teaspoon of mushroom seasoning powder, which is made from dried mushrooms and it also contains salt. You can use any seasoning powder. And then to make our pasta sauce nice and creamy, we're adding three to four tablespoons of mayonnaise. Now don't panic, you have to try this. It really does work. Uh, I'm adding three ta tablespoons first and then I, you can add more later if you need to. Once the mayonnaise is added, you want to stir this briskly and quickly into the sauce. And we're also going to add liquid from the canned mushrooms. I add the whole can of liquid here. This ensures that our spaghetti is not dry. Now we're going to add the cooked spaghetti and just toss, toss, toss it till it's nice and coated with this lovely sauce. You can add a little bit more of the liquid if there's any left, as well as um, a little bit of mayonnaise if you want it a little creamier. And as the final touch, a quarter teaspoon of liquid smoke. I'm using hickory liquid smoke here. It really does add that final special touch to this dish. It adds a nice smoky aroma and flavor as well. Use it if you have it and try this pasta. It's really tasty and it's so quick. For something so quick, it's really delicious. And garnish as desired and add grated Parmesan if you like. And your pasta dish is ready. And you can switch this up by adding a little bit of smoked sausage 
um, if you like. But uh, today we're making it purely vegetarian. So I hope you try this quick recipe on those days that you really need something quick and instant. Thanks for watching. Bye.